Black Day observed across Northeast. The Northeast Students Organization, in a bid to express solidarity with the victims of police firing in Tripura and Imphal, hoisted black flags across the entire region today. The All Assam Students Union members hoisted a black flag at their office, Swahid Nias in Gohati, earlier this morning as a mark of protest. Terming the Saffron Party and its government as betrayers, members of ASU expressed their anger by observing a black day today. Din to the Amar Nasor, the Potini Dola Sile, Utter Ponsola, Bondor Homoisuat, Tripura, the Arokir, Barbar, or Tesla Bolihol, Heokolo Durbugiar, Hobolo Dante, Arokizi, Badar Ponan Kule, Gonantantic, De Akonazi, Badar Ponan Kule, the Pesis, Monobazi, Sorkar, the Kajokola, the Kile, a good Pesis, Sorkar, Kajokola, Kami Tibro, Birodi. In Nagaland, the Naga Students' Federation, along with the NESO, showcased resentment against the perpetration of state-sponsored atrocities against the public and the indigenous people. Meanwhile, in Itanagar, the All Arunachal Pradesh Students' Union, led by General Secretary Tobam Dai, took part in the protest. In Tripura, in the state of Tripura, the police have indiscriminately fired upon the innocent, agitating protesters, and five, five student activists have been grievously injured. On that account, our national leaders, led by Dr. Samujal Bhattacharya, the Chairman Samuel Jera, our Secretary General Sinam Prakash Singh, have visited Tripura. But the police, the government of Tripura, the BJP government in Tripura, have stopped, have not allowed our national leaders to meet the uh, victims of the police firing. So this is a very sad development. So in this regard, all of the seven states, the FX students' body of seven states in the northeast are today in solidarity with the uh, Tripura student federations is uh, observing a black day. APSU is the apex students' body in Arunachal Pradesh under the ages of the NESO and has time and again extended support to it in protest against the Citizenship Amendment Bill. In Mizoram, the Mizo Zillai Paul took the lead. In solidarity with the Neso's condemnation of the BJP-led government's attempts to push through the Citizenship Amendment Bill in the Parliament, the MZP also denounced and demanded that such a situation does not recur. I'm here with the MZP senior leader and the Neso Finance Secretary Ricky Lalbiak Moya. Hello. The, uh, the BJP governments uh, throughout Northeast, uh, like in Tripura and in Manipur and somewhere else, uh, uh, they were, you know, um, there was a very brutal uh, uh, efforts to crush the protests uh, by this uh, government. Uh, this is really, really unfortunate, and it shocks us. Uh, so. Uh, we really condemn that thing, and it is against the indigenous, pe indigenous people. Uh, in, uh, so, trying to crush the indigenous people, uh, so uh, we condemn that thing. And uh, we are going to uh, uh, declare, we declared uh, today, uh, the 12th of uh, February, uh, January, yes, the uh, January as the Black Day throughout the Northeast. And on this day, uh, we are going, uh, we are going to host a black flag in uh, uh, each of our respective states. In Imphal, student bodies under the ages of the NESO also marked Black Day in a similar way. <laughs> student bodies namely AMSU, MSF, DESAM, SUK and AIMS were a part of it. The reason why we stay such uh, sit in protest and uh, later on uh, a mass daily because the recently uh, uh, parliament passed bill, namely so-called uh, the, the, the citizenship uh, amendment in 2016 will be uh, affected severely in the northeast, particularly in Manipur. This is just like an atom bomb 
um, to, to the northeast. So we strongly condemn the such uh, the bill. Although the primary reason behind the widespread protest these days is the contentious citizenship bill being passed in the Lok Sabha, Neso is observing a black day today against the centre and the atrocities of the Tripura police on student activists concerning the aftermath of the 11-hour Neso Band on the 8th of January where five student protesters were shot at by the police personnel in Tripura. A seven-member Neso delegation led by Chief Advisor Samujal Bhattacharya went to Khumlong on Friday to take stock of the situation following the police firing. However, they were reportedly stopped by the Tripura police at Khumlang and not allowed to meet any of the protesters who got injured in the firing. Apart from this, Black Day is also being observed to condemn the police firing on the protesters in Imphal yesterday where four persons were injured while protesting against the bill. Bureau Report, Northeast Live.